everyone, my name is Olivia Rose. I have a brand new single out right now. It's called Gold. It is available on all your favorite streaming platforms. As well, the gorgeous lyric video is out on YouTube right now. I'm super excited because it goes to Canadian Country Radio on March 15th. So today I'm doing five quick questions with the reviews are in, so let's go. Question number one. If you're at home listening to music, which album would you reach for if you were going to play it with no skips? I think I would have to say Taylor Swift, Folklore, and then followed by Evermore. Because I, I like Evermore mo more, <laughs> but to get the whole T-Swift experience, I feel like you have to listen to it in order, and that's probably like three hours of music. So I can just imagine myself like with tea on a Sunday listening to both of those albums <laughs> and just picture myself by the coast somewhere. Mm -hmm. Evermore and Folklore. Question two, do you have a dream stage you'd like to play someday? I think the obvious answer for any country singer is the Grand Ole Opry, of course, but I think it would be really, really cool to play a sold out show at the Rogers Stadium here in Edmonton, where I'm from, because I've been there so many times and I've, I've watched all of these idols, people I look up to perform there. And I think that that would be a really full circle moment for me if I got to play on that stage to a sold out crowd. I think that'd be really cool that or like a really cool music festival like Coachella or something. Um, question three, who is at the top of your dream collaboration list that you haven't worked with yet? I have to say Miranda Lambert because she has been such a huge inspiration to me ever since I was like so little listening to Kerosene and Gunpowder and Lead and, and Mama's Broken Heart and all those ones. Um, she just did a really, really cool collaboration with Elle King. Uh, their song is incredible. And if I ever got to do something like that with her, that would just be like amazing. Like I could die happy. So Miranda Lambert, final answer. Question four, can you tell us something about yourself that we wouldn't find in your bio? Yeah, so I was actually born with a cleft palate. And for those of you who don't know what a cleft palate is, basically I was born with a hole in the top of my mouth. <laughs> Usually a cleft palate also comes with a cleft lip and that's when you see people that have a scar right here if it's been fixed with surgery. Um, luckily I was not born with a cleft lip as well, but being born with a cleft palate, I had to endure tons of surgeries and stuff because that also messes up like hearing and, and all of your nasal passages. And so when I was really little and well up until I was probably about 10 years old, um, I dealt with being sick like all the time with post nasal drip and strep throat and so Yeah, it was kind of hard because I remember like most of the shows that I was singing at or playing I was sick and I had to kind of deal with that um, It also came with uh, I had to work really hard on my pronunciation and so I did some speech therapy when I was little and so yeah, that's probably it. It's on the internet. It's around. I've talked about it before but it's not not everyone knows about that. So yeah, I was born with a cleft palate. And question number five, is there a band or artist that you think people should be paying more attention to? I definitely wanna say Lindy Ortega. Um, she is absolutely incredible. I know a lot of people do know her, especially in Canada, um, but I cannot get enough of her. Like I, I actually have a signed record from her just sitting right over there. Uh, I got to go see her when I was probably 14 years old. And she is just an incredible musician and songwriter and like the kindest person that you'd ever meet. So Lindy Ortega is somebody that people should be paying more attention to. And that was the final question. So thank you so much. The reviews are in. I really, really appreciate being here. Once again, my name is Olivia Rose and my brand new single Gold is out right now. Thanks. Bye. as well at <laughs> way more attention to Edmonton <laughs> I'm super excited because why am I excited? Who knows?